Hi everyone, my name is Dr Sheila Kanani and I work in the education team at the Royal Astronomical Society. This month we've joined with our friends at Girl Guiding to create a really fun Adventures at Home challenge all about stargazing. Have you ever looked up into the night sky and saw something amazing and then you've gone to take a photo of it but it just doesn't look the same? Today I'm going to share with you our top three tips on how to improve your astrophotography skills. Now astrophotography is the practice of taking photos of astronomical objects like planets or stars, celestial events like solar eclipses or meteor showers and areas of the night sky. The first photo of an astronomical object was taken back in 1840 using a reflective telescope. But nowadays you can use a camera, a smartphone or tablet to capture the amazing things you see in the sky. Here's our top three tips for taking better photos of the stars. Tip number one, use a long exposure setting or app. This is great for landscape photography as it slows down the shutter speed of your camera. This means that your camera can take in more light so you can capture for a longer period of time. To do this, look at your camera settings for a button called exposure. We recommend setting it between 15 and 30 seconds. If you don't have an exposure button, there are lots of long exposure free apps you can download and use on your smartphone. You can play around with the features to test out different exposure times and find out what works best. Tip number two, use a tripod, stand or stack of books or anything like that to keep your phone still. This will help the images be sharper and clearer and less blurry. Tip number three, turn the flash off. Stars are very, very far away. And this will help your camera try to take the light in from the stars and not things closer to your camera. Also, some newer phones have an astrophotography setting built into them. So look to see if you have this function too and play around to see what works best for your night sky. Why not take some photos before and after using our top tips to see how different they look? Can you see the stars more clearly now? Keep experimenting and improving your astrophotography skills. And who knows, you might capture the next new discovery. Show us how you're getting along using the hashtag Adventures at Home. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you've enjoyed finding out a little bit about astrophotography and our top tips for how to take better photos of the night sky. Bye.